I'm Tom Schumann, editor of the Indiana Chamber's Biz Voice magazine. Our current issue features a cover story on drones. Joining us today is Dwayne Embry, executive director of the Indiana Office of Defense Development. Dwayne, Indiana wasn't selected as, as a test site, uh, a bid between Indiana and Ohio, but that certainly hasn't slowed activity in this area, has it? No, not at all. The, uh, the test sites were selected to um, ensure uh, safety, flight safety, integrity of the vehicles. Um, we think we should have been selected, but we're moving on. I think the, uh, the thing we're focusing on is the applications. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of testing, a lot of work development work going on. Uh, talk about some of the practical applications for drones that we see. You know, I think that um, probably the most uh, important and, and near term for us is in precision agriculture. We see that um, in other parts of the world, in Europe, uh, across the, uh, the world. We haven't taken it on much yet, but I think that's a real opportunity for us with unmanned systems. Dwayne, let's talk time frame. I know that we're waiting on FAA rulings and so forth, but is there a realistic time frame of when we might see some regular operations? Right now, uh, commercial business is not allowed by the FAA, but um, public service kind of things, research uh, is allowed. Um, my personal opinion is that the um, uh, technology and opportunities may get ahead of the FAA and so we'll see public service kind of things we'll see uh, research being done before we see commercial thank you Duane you can read much more about this in the current issue of BizVoice magazine log on to bizvoicemagazine.com